Hello, yes, it's me, Holly Agambar, back with an instant match reaction because Tottenham have just lost 4-2 to Man City away from home. If you're new to the channel, please remember to like, share, comment and subscribe so you never miss a video. Yes, ah, uh, it's Holly's Hotspurs back with another one. Chatting all things Tottenham, we're second to none. Special guests every time, if it's win, lose or draw. The passion is high like Harry Kane when he scores. Or when Lloris makes a world-class save. We got Hoybier running the mid every game. Settle down, stick around, say your thoughts with the panel. And make sure you're subscribing to the channel. Coys. Yes, ladies and gents, we have just lost 4-2 uh, to Man City. We actually did the reversal today. Normally we have a crap first half and then come out all guns blazing in the second half. Uh, this time we did it the other way around and we were actually 2-0 up uh, at half-time. We saw the likes of um, Kulaveski after brilliant um, pressure for Ben Tencourt. It really shows that we do really miss him uh, when Ben Tencourt isn't about. Um, his work rate in the middle was great. It just wasn't enough to compete, obviously, against City. And then, out of all people, we see Emerson Royale also get on the score sheet, who I must say, I do slate him an awful lot, but he actually had a decent game today. Um, and he managed to be rewarded with a goal. We went into the half at half-time, at 2-0 up. Uh, but then I think uh, Pep got the hairdryers out at half-time because within, I think it was 12 minutes, we conceded three goals. <laughs> so that pretty much uh, sums up how the game went. Um, it all kind of went to pot. And one of the people to blame for that was uh, Hugo Lloris once again. I, I, don't know how, I don't know how I can defend him anymore. You literally can't. Uh, one of the I think the first goal was for obviously from Haaland. Nothing really could have done. Second goal, it didn't really need to come out. Third goal, he just opens his legs wide open. Need I say no more, because that'd be a whole other subject. We'll leave that. But uh, it's clearly to say that he has been on the wine once again. Um, we really need to think about shifting one. Like all things, we kind of leave it too late. Um, and now we're kind of getting, I was going to say the rewards for it. It's not really a reward, it's a punishment. Um, so yeah, 4-2 away from home. I was really thinking uh, at the second half, I think this is typical uh, we obviously have Arsenal at home, we lose to them, then we go to City and we bounce back by beating them. Um, obviously, we are their bogey team, but today was not the day. And now we have Fulham to look forward to on Monday. I think if we lose to Fulham, that will mean that we go below them in the league, uh, which isn't great. The only consolation, if I'm trying to put a positive spin on it, is the fact that uh, obviously it means that City are, are trying to close the gap between um, them and Arsenal. So it does us a little bit of a favour, but not really. That just kind of shows you where we are in the grand scheme of things. Let me know your thoughts on the game below. Holly Sotspurs Live will be back differently this week. Uh, obviously, because we are playing Fulham on Monday, Holly Sotspurs Live will be back on the Tuesday, which will be weird, I know, but make sure you're around for that one. Thank you to everybody that is new to the channel that has subscribed. Uh, I really appreciate it. I feel like we all need a therapy session at the moment supporting Tottenham. So if you haven't already, you've just stumbled across this video, make sure you subscribe. And I'll like, see you next time. Come with you Spurs.